what up what up what up it's your boy jb coming right back at you man welcome back to the channel had to jump on here real fast why the heisman race is a two-man race why the heisman race is a two-man race now if you guys are fans of the channel you already know that travis hunter uh really solidified himself as a top tier heisman candidate with the victory over ucf right but i've been saying the whole year after week one, that you need to watch out for Cam Ward of Miami. And once again, even though he threw the pick six in the game last night, this boy is must-see TV as well. And, and I can tell you like this, the Buffs didn't play this weekend, but Cam Ward showed that he's about that life. Cam Ward showed that you can trust that man at the end. And y'all know I'm a Shador fan, I'm a Travis Hunter fan, but this kind of goes back to what what Cam Newton was talking about. Cam Newton was talking about how many signature wins does uh does 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 Shador have. Now granted, Cal is not necessarily a good team. And the only thing that's hurting Cam Ward is he played late last night and a lot of people didn't see it. They just gonna see the highlights. They're not gonna see the ups and downs of how the coach still put the ball in his hand at the end. And the interview afterwards <laughs> showed you he a real one. Uh, well Off Media just reposted it, uh, that, that interview he had afterwards. It's two-man race, guys. Cam Ward, and here's the deal why I think Cam Ward may have a better chance at it than Travis Hunter. Not from a not from a talent, not from a talent perspective. People hate Deion Sanders. The media hates Deion Sanders. You can't punish Deion, but you can't punish Travis Hunter. Cam Ward, on the other hand, right? Cam Ward is using Shador as the as the model of who he's trying to overtake. Cam Ward knows, you know, uh, just like the quarterback from Virginia Tech. I'm, I'm drawing a blank right now. Cam Ward that, you know, when they beat Virginia Tech, OK, check him off the list. And Cam Ward released that video that when I beat him, you can call me one and then you can call the other two, two A and two B. He doesn't care. Cam Ward wants to show people that he's better than Shador. Shador doesn't have to show anybody that he's better than anybody because, again, Shador, Shador's just a hell of a quarterback. He did what he did last year when nobody expected somebody from HBCU to come do what he did uh, in the Pac-12 last year when they were in the Pac-12. But this is a two-man race, guys. And I got to tell you, as much as I'm a Travis Hunter fan, I think it can Ward keep playing like this because Milro, when they lost last night to Vanderbilt, they out of it. Right. He he should have willed his team to a victory over Vanderbilt. That shouldn't have happened. Two man, two man race. Cam Ward, Travis Hunter. Although I'm a Travis Hunter fan, although I want to see Travis Hunter win it. This is showing you as long as Travis Hunter don't get hurt like he got hurt last year. And if Cam Ward keep playing the way he's playing, I think the media is going to give it to Cam Ward because they hate Deion Sanders, man. They hate what Deion represents. And, and even though it's a two-man race, Travis Hunter is going to have to play lights out. What do we just mean? Dion going to have to get him 150 yards per game. He's going to have to get one or two interceptions per game. He's going to have to have game-changing plays that show up on the news after every game from here on out if he want to beat Cam Ward because he's not going to get a fair shake in the media. All of us with our regular eyes can see Travis Hunter is the best player in college football. Even Shador said it on his podcast. But Cam Ward... Cam Ward keeps playing like this. It's a two-man race. And unfortunately, because people hate Dion, I think they're going to give it to Cam Ward. And Cam Ward got a chip on his shoulder because he wants to show that even though me and Shador train together, I want you all to see that I should be the number one quarterback taken off the board. I should be the one that everybody's giving props to. And he showed it last night. So let's see what happens, guys. Two-man race at this point. Travis Hunter, Cam Ward. Get down in the comment section. Let me know what you think, man. Is Jeff crazy or is Jeff owning something? If you hadn't already, mash that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Turn on that bell for notifications, and until next time, I'm going to holler.